Reports are out that Gus Malzahn has agreed to a new deal to stay as Auburn's head coach. Now, the deal is reported to be seven years and close to $7 million per season. Dylan, with this reported new deal for Malzahn, how uh, do you think Auburn will perform under Gus Malzahn for these seven years? More specifically, do you think they'll win a national championship? I mean, you're asking an Auburn fan. i got to put my cards out on the table. <laughs> sure. My wishful thinking and hopeful belief in my Speak with your mind, tigers. not your heart. This is a team that had a very good chance, save a lackluster offensive performance after their first drive yesterday in the SEC championship that could be competing for a national championship right now. So it's hard to think that they're going to completely fall off, especially if he's there for seven years. If you get that continuity, we know he's a very, very sharp, offensive-minded football coach that constantly figures out how to put points on the board and reinvent that offense. A lot of spread, and, and, and that is going to draw top-tier blue-chip type recruits to Auburn. I really feel like with the somewhat falling off of LSU, it's not like LSU has gone away, but I don't think they're that national power top three program. They've been, when Les Miles was there some years ago, I think Auburn has been a beneficiary of that. I think Florida falling off after Urban Meyer. Auburn has been a beneficiary of that within the Southeastern Conference. I think they will continue to do that, and I think they will compete for a national championship and win one national championship in that seven-year deal. And I think this was Auburn's kind of reaction to so many of the rumors of him going to Arkansas. Look, he's an Arkansas yeah. guy. Ties. He, play, yeah, he played in Arkansas. Yeah. He, he was an offensive coordinator under Houston Nutt back in 06 at Arkansas. Coached at Arkansas State. Had that legendary run at Hughes High School in Arkansas. So does it surprise you that he's staying at Auburn? Because, no. I mean, Arkansas offered him a similarly lucrative deal. Right, right. We were hearing a lot of north of $7 million, so... I, you know, Auburn's like, cool, we can roll sevens too. Seven years, seven million. We'll, we'll make you happy. I think the go from Auburn to Arkansas is a step down in job, mm -hmm. but it could. We don't know. I don't know. I can't speak for Gus. It could be such a dream job that you're willing to step down to go to Arkansas. It's yeah. a tough place to win considering who you have to deal with in that SEC West. We know Brett Bielema had a hell of a time uh, and didn't do too well. That's why he's out, but I'm not surprised. I think he's had great success at Auburn. I think he wants to continue that. And they made it certainly worth his while with all this money as far as the reports go. 10-3 mm -hmm. record this year. We'll see if uh, before his seven years are up, maybe he's extended beyond that. Maybe, but maybe in he wins seven, seven national years, championships. Maybe he wins one each year. Every year. D that would make Dylan McGordy very, very happy. Come on, Gus. Let's get it done. For all of your college football news, keep it locked right here on Stadium. Before we